At this point, I would like to recognize our fabulous, fabulous sponsors. A touch of frost, of course, it's cold not only because of the season which we are not experiencing in the valley, but by the sponsor, the Frost Bank. Incredible sponsor for many, many years of the Valley Symphony Orchestra and Chorale. Well, your organization doesn't run on 10 cents. So for you to continue to expand, and, I, and I'm gonna use a touch of frost when you have the entire choral there, and you have all those fantastic musicians, and and they need to be paid, they need, they're given their time, they're given more than their time to provide a wonderful entertainment and a wonderful education to people like me. Well, uh, the Touch of Frost, of course, is the holiday music, so we usually get together in, in uh, September and start singing The Messiah or a Silent Night or Deck the Halls, things like that. And so um, as we get closer to Christmas, of course, it, it picks up speed, but uh, yeah, we're celebrating Christmas pretty early. I, I'm telling you, that's that's probably my favorite one. It, it leaves you with just this great feeling of Christmas. You've, you feel like you were just dipped in Christmas. It's, it's awesome. I love Christmas time, and I think most people do. That particular concert, it kind of attacks from all angles of Christmas. The classical version, the, the more pops version, you know, and, and we try to get everybody involved in that Christmas feeling. That Frost concert is awesome. When, uh, a good friend of ours in, in town, one of her favorite concerts is the, the Christmas concert. I know that that um, is a big tradition for many families who love music mm -hmm. and um, want to continue to support it. So I'm, I'm grateful for things like that. I really liked how we did it the week before Thanksgiving and it reminded me of just being with my family and the time that we spend singing Christmas carols in church or at home and putting up the Christmas tree. And so I can't re wait to bring my family and my kids to the concert when they get a little bit older. And I really like being able to see all the family members that come dressed up and you can see that they've been going for years and maybe it's a part of their family tradition. I think for me, getting to hear the choir performing with the orchestra, the chorale brings so much, um, so much more to the full body of sound. So that was really great. And they did an amazing job. I like you to think about the musical talent that's gathered back here that is very unique and that is second to nobody in this great country and it is full of South Texas talent. Sec And of course, it's, it's led by what I call the dancing maestro, because I love when he, he gets going. 